possible life forms for Europa. On Europa, things are different, and before our creature is revealed to you, let us go over the facts. Europa is a moon orbiting Jupiter, that is known for having an ocean beneath the surface. But wait, you might say. It's cold as shit down there. Well my friend Dorinos, you are correct. It is below 260 degrees down there, and at the poles it is 360 and below. But wait. Europa has a chance of having vents where volcanic activity happens, and it bumps the instantly killing cold temperature to a nice 40 degrees. It has an oxygen atmosphere, although small, that the sun made by hitting the water. My creature is the wacky waving inflatable arm flailing tube worm. We will just call it the WWIAFT. The WWIAFT is a creature that is very similar to the giant tube worms that live on the bottom of our oceans. The WWIAFT can move but probably will not do it, lives roughly 10 years and reproduces by budding. It lives in clusters, processes water to oxygen and releases the gases through its tubes and the bacteria surrounding it that can convert hydrogen sulfide to nourishing chemicals. Here is a video of a representation of the creature. Originally we were going to get Morgan Freedom take the part but he declined. Instead we've got some hobo, who used to work at a pizzeria. This is your jump scare warning of the day, if you have a faint heart on to you look, at what the bacteria looks like in 3, 2, 1. God that creature is disturbing. Anyway, this creature, as I mentioned earlier can move, but would have difficulty leaving the bottom of the ocean. There are several earth versions of this creature so we are going to show a clip of them fighting off predators. What are you? That is some good stuff. God bless America. Realistically, it would be able to survive there. It has the right temperature, extreme OFO bacteria can live there without a care. It has its nourishment, plenty of water, and it doesn't need to leave there, unless it needs to beat a man. Inhale my dong you enragement child. 